Hey everybody, it's your favorite crazy person here. Um, as you can see, I've done something a little bit special to my eyebrows and hopefully this can sort of foreshadow you to what I'm going to be doing in today's video. Today's video is actually a redo of a video that I tried to do a couple of weeks ago but when I tried to do it a couple of weeks ago I was just completely out of focus and I just wanted to scrap the whole thing, start all over again and that's what I'm doing today. Hopefully today's one will turn out a lot better. So as you can see from my blocked out eyebrows maybe you can tell but I'm going to be doing drag makeup um, and I'm gonna be retrying to do the drag makeup of the same drag queen that I tried to do in my previous video and that is Trixie Mattel. I tried to get on my best sort of like country girl outfit but you can't really tell it's just the classic little played little thing. I thought maybe the cherries gave like a little bit of a country vibe because like it's like country pie Ugh, cherry pie or something like that it doesn't really make that much sense but I thought I'd go ahead with it um so on my eyebrows I put down two layers of uh, boz stick blue glue stick and I powdered in between each layer and they feel very weird they kind of still feel tacky even with like all the powder on top of them but I'm just gonna be making do making do with what I have. So first step is first and I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty uh, Pro Filter foundation all over my face. <laughs> we are not going for subtlety. We are going for woman. Sorry, I put an AirPod in and I started listening to a podcast because I figured that this is going to take me a while. So I've just put on the Fenty Beauty foundation. I haven't blended on my neck or anything like that because I'm like, it doesn't really matter. I'm not going for a subtle makeup look. It, it doesn't matter if it doesn't match my neck. Um, I'm going to go in with the ColourPop concealer in light 16. I can already see my eyebrows starting to like lift up right here. Let's pray for the best. Now what we're gonna do is we are gonna take a big old powder puff and we're gonna fucking... <laughs> this seems right. Okay, we have done the base. We look like a true egg. What do you do when you look like an egg? You start to contour. So I'm gonna be using the Makeup uh, the makeup Revolution Stick Foundation. I got this in the shade F14. My camera says that it's overheating a little bit, but we will just power through. Um, I'm having trouble with this foundation stick. I feel like I'm putting too much on my face. <laughs> okay, my face looks freaking weird. I've made a choice with it. Um, I'm going to use the NYX contour palette and I'm going to use this one to sort of, I guess, set down the atrocity that I've already put down on my face. <laughs> this looks so bad. So bad. I'm going to use this brush on that same dark brown contour shade. I'm going to use that on my nose. Okay, and now I'm going to take this BYS cheek palette thing. Uh, I'm going to take the, maybe this brighter shade down here. I feel like that's very tricksy. I'm going to use, oh, <laughs> I'm going to use this much on my face. I guess I should, I guess I should tap off the excess. I don't want to look friggin' 
too blushed. I'm gonna take this picture of Trixie um, and I'm gonna use this as a base level of like where my eyes should be. Uh, it's gonna be a lot. Basically, I'm gonna use a white pencil just to sort of sketch out where it should be. Um, and then I'm gonna use a thicker NYX Jumbo eye pencil in the color Milk. And I'm gonna use that to sort of like properly lay down some white. Oh yeah, I think I'll do the eyeliner first. Wait, maybe I should do an outline of liquid liner. Okay, so what I did is I put on a lot of gel eyeliner to make it and then I also set it down with some black eyeshadow and then I also went in with the NYX white jumbo white pencil or whatever and did this bit in here and then set that down with white eyeshadow as well and then because there was like obviously fallout from the white shadow I had just had to go over the black part with some black shadow again but what I think will make this pop is I'm going to take some of the uh, Too Faced glitter glue. I'm going to put that on the back of my hand. I'm going to dab it on some of the white bits and then I'm also going to put a very fine white glitter on top of it. I hope it's going to look okay. I feel like maybe I've seen Trixie do that before but like... <laughs> Okay, I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but it's just some really cute like glitter on the white bits there. Okay, so now I'm going to go in with the uh, BH Cosmetics. You take me back to Brazil and I'm going to focus on the blue parts. This is going to go weird on the eyebrow, but oops. I feel like now is as good a time as any to start the eyebrows. The only brush I have is like my normal brush that I use for my eyebrows. I'm going to take the Kat Von D Shade and Light Eye Palette and I'm going to take this lightest shade. I'm going to use that to draw on my eyebrow. So this is what we've done with our eyebrows. Um, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take some concealer, flat brush, maybe ruin it. We're just gonna try cleaning it up. I'm gonna go back into the eyeshadows and kind of deepen up those blues. Okay, I'm gonna put lips on. What I have is this BH Cosmetics liquid lip in the color Princess. It's bright ass pink. And I'm gonna put this on and then I'm gonna come back with lashes on. Oh 
This is very streaky, but I'm trying my best. Boy, are you kidding me? These lower lashes haven't properly dried yet, but I think that this is as good as we're gonna get. Um, I realized that I didn't do any sort of like highlighter on my face, so let's do that. I'm gonna use the Anastasia Sugar Glow Kit. I think I'm gonna use Mmm, Starburst, maybe? Around this point is the time when my parents came home, so I felt really weird about just like yelling an outro um, to a video. So, you know, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, put a comment down below, tell me some ideas, type in your ideas so that I can think of things because I don't have original thoughts. I'll see you later. Goodbye. That's basically what she's trying to mime right now tipping a hat to the lady um goodbye